Hi y'all, it's your girl Shanti. I'm sorry I'm looking a little down right now. I'm going through a lot of stress as well. For me being sick and Lyric being sick, I passed the sickness down to my two-year-old daughter and it's not a good feeling at all. But if you're new to our channel, make sure you guys subscribe now and hit that bell for post notifications. It's your girl Shanti, it's the Ashanti Tribe. And make sure you guys stay tuned to the rest of this lit video. Me and Lyric slept on the couch because it's more colder in the living room and She's thirsty right now. Guys, she does have a fever because she's very hot. But when I went to the doctor, they told me to just treat her like I treat myself. I got all these medications and stuff, so she most likely came down with something that I had. But yeah, y'all, she was sleeping on me all night on my chest. I just kept holding her, make her feel secure. <coughs> she's also been coughing. She's not feeling too good. You can tell she's very sick. And she's just been underneath me pretty much the whole night, very clingy. And she wasn't clingy when she first got home. So I'm going to just keep monitoring <coughs> her, making sure she's good. It's been a long, long road, y'all. We're going to do everything we can to make sure she's great. I'm still tired. I literally slept in this position all night. I kept her right on this chest right here. And I'm just drained, y'all. Like I don't think I have any more life or energy in me left. All these different medications they got me taking. And I don't even know how to feel right now, honestly. I just, just hope that me and Larry can recover properly and get past this. So the boys can come home and we all could be a big, happy family. Good morning, Mama. Is you okay? You okay, Lyric? Guys, she's been on my chest all night. But she's been like, laying on my leg for the past five minutes now she's hot i've been giving her stuff to drink so she doesn't get dehydrated and i just hope that she feels better like i'm so sorry that i passed this sickness down to my baby i knew it was gonna come soon because she was already in my face before i even tested positive for anything so i knew it was gonna be a problem you okay baby you okay baby you all right Want me to give you a hug? Do you want some more drink? Huh? Guys, she's not even in the mood for smiling, jumping, running, talking. She's just out of it, y'all. And I know she was going to get it worse than I did because she's a baby. Her immune system is very, very weak, y'all. Honestly, y'all, it sucks being sick. Like, why is this happening to us? Why? And it's around the holidays, like Christmas is coming up. And it's just not fair to me or her or anybody out there that's sick around this time. Because this is the perfect time to be around your family, to have laughs, love, everything. And we're just here sick. I, I don't think I've ever been sick on Christmas. Ever, 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 ever. And I think it's from me traveling to South Carolina to New York. I probably got sick on my way to New York. I just had to stop into a couple of states, but gas, you never know who was sick. They put it had germs on the gas pumps. Somebody could have been sick in the bathroom that I went to because we had to take bathroom breaks. But y'all, it's too much. I have no taste. I have no smell. It's just horrible. Lyric. Come here, mamas. Want to lay on mommy? Yeah, she's definitely not feeling good, y'all. <coughs> yeah, her heart is beating really fast, too. At least she still looks pretty like her mom when she's sick. You okay, mamas? Not doing too much talking. I just hope we get past this so quickly, y'all. Just please pray for us. Like, this is a hard time that we're going through, and... I wouldn't wish this on my worst enemy, and I just wish that everything would get better. Like, now, it's just hard for us. Like, we've just been in the house quarantining. We don't got nobody else to talk to, nobody else that wants to come over here. They don't want to get sick. It's been a lot of struggles that we've been through. We we're going to make it because we got each other. And I just love my beautiful daughter. I do. You want to say hi? Two? Y'all, she's very hot too. I had a fan in my room, but I didn't bring it in here because I don't want to make the sickness worse. I don't know if it's going to make it worse by me bringing a fan. 
So I just said, you know what? I'm going to just have her break this fever. But I do have some medications too that I could also give her as well. But I didn't give it to her yet. You have something to say? Huh? Huh, baby? I'm sorry. Right after your birthday, this is not a good time, Lyric. <sighs> this sucks. I'm so sorry, baby. What do you guys normally take for your sicknesses? Do you guys drink tea and soup and stuff like that? Yeah, tell me what you guys normally do to break the sickness, because this is a lot on us. Like, uh, I don't even know what else to say or what else to do. Y'all, this is just crazy. I knew something was wrong because when I was wrapping those gifts, I noticed like she just kept sleeping and she normally doesn't sleep. Normally she's like the happiest baby. She'll get up and start running around and making all this noise and play with her toys and yada, yada, yada. But she did not do that this time. She did not. She just kept sleeping. And I'm just like, what is going on? Like, person that knows their child and been around their child. I know I wasn't around her for that long, but I've been around her for like a couple days. And I've been watching how she reacts to certain things. And normally she'd be like the happiest person in the morning. Like she woke me up out of my sleep in the morning. So for me to wake up and she's not doing that and it's just nothing but quietness. Oh, it's an issue. So y'all, I just, oh my God. Like this is just so stressful. Like seriously, like there's so much things I want to meet her to do. And we couldn't even do. We had to throw all the plans off. Because of this sickness, like, please pray for us, y'all. This is not how she normally is. She's not even smiling, y'all. She's upset. She's sad. This is how I looked when I first got sick for a couple days ago. Mine's just starting to wear off now, but Jesus Christ. Why, my baby, though? Why, why, why? Are you okay, Lyric? I love you. Do you want a drink again? Do you want mommy to get you something to drink? I got some Pedia, Pedia, I don't even know what it's called. Pedia Light, I think. It helps with sickness, dehydration. Ugh. Guys, don't mind my hair. Want some more to drink? Huh? You want some more to drink? She's probably not even worried about nothing else to drink right now. I'm going to try to push as much fluids as I can because the doctor told me to take care of her like I would take care of myself. But I'll take care of myself a little less than this. I, I pamper her. I didn't have nobody to lay on when I was sick. I tried to lay on her, but she didn't want to lay on me. But I didn't want to get too close to her either. I also didn't want to get her sick, so... is so gorgeous she looks like a little doll baby y'all you okay yeah hi oh my poor baby i'm sorry baby i'm sorry you're going through this i'm so sorry it's all mommy's fault and she's a baby so it's hard for her to tell me how she's feeling i don't know if she's having any like aching I don't know if she would be crying at this point. She can't tell me if she has any smell, any taste, or anything. I know when I was sick, I still don't even have a taste or smell. So I can only imagine what she's going through. And it really sucks because I've been eating some really nice food, like soups and stuff. And I've been wanting to taste the broth, and I can't even taste it. All I feel is warm, like warmness in my mouth. That's all I was feeling. So I'm just like, oh my God, this really sucks and I just feel like crap. I broke this nail too yesterday after I got done wrapping the gifts. I'm a hot mess, y'all, and I just don't want you guys to judge me. And I mean, this is life. We all live to get sick. We all live to die, but this is just horrible, y'all. This is around the holidays, and she just had a birthday, so I wouldn't wish this on anybody. Like, seriously, like, no, can't. I just wouldn't. No. Absolutely not. No. Okay.
Come on, mamas. I got to go pee. Can I go to the bathroom? I'm surprised I didn't wake up in the middle of the night to use the bathroom, y'all. She been laying on me this whole night just like this. Laying just on me just like this. I got to go pee pee. Can I go pee pee? I, I don't got a pamper to wear just like you. You can pee in your pamper. I can't. Ah. Can I go pee pee? <laughs> oh. You coughing, mamas? I'm going to start giving you some medicine. But it's really early, but I'm still going to give you some medicine. But can I go pee first? Huh, baby? Baby, can I get up and go pee? Wish I could take you with me. I'm going to have to lay you down real quick so mommy can go pee. Come on. Come on, mamas. Not trying to let me go, y'all. <laughs> oh, she's not trying to let me go. All right, I got to go pee pee. Can I go pee? You sound like you're about to start throwing up. Mamas, can I go pee? She's not trying to let me go for nothing, y'all. Oh, Larry, I gotta lay you down. Mommy gotta go pee. Can I go pee? I gotta go pee. Guys, I'm gonna pee it on myself. <laughs> this little girl doesn't even want me to go. Let me put you down right here, okay? I know, I know, babe. Just lay down, okay? I had to put these sheets over here and on the floor because I think she was about to throw up yesterday. And I didn't want her throwing up on the couch. So I said, you know what? I'm gonna just put the stuff on the floor just in case because at least I could throw it in the washing machine. Oh, look at my hair. I look like wild woman but it's okay because i'm still here and i'm still vlogging and i'm not going anywhere but y'all i'm about to go upstairs now to use this bathroom real quick and come back and give my baby girl something to drink We're in a couple days away from Christmas. Why? Why? <sighs> At least I'm able to smile. I wasn't able to smile a couple days ago. Just looked straight miserable. I had the lyric face. Like I was just out of it. Like I didn't care about anything else. And it's just crazy, y'all. Like for real. All right, y'all. So I'm done using the bathroom. So now I'm gonna go back downstairs and get lyric something to drink. I don't know if she went back. <coughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I don't know if she went back to sleep, but we're gonna go check now. I don't like leaving her by herself. Just really had to use the bathroom, y'all. Yeah, she's knocked out, y'all. And so she's sleeping. Let me just let her rest. She's knocked out, as you guys can see. She's knocked out. She's tired, y'all. My baby. Love you. Love you, princess. All right, y'all, so Lyric did drink a lot of some tea. I made some warm tea, but I let it cool down. She had some of that, I didn't want her to get dehydrated. She's laying there, she's doing pretty good, she's breathing good, she's a little bit warm still. And like the doctor said, just keep examining her and we both will get through this. Just treat her like I would treat myself, but just treat her a little bit better because that's my mini me and that's my baby. And her immune system is weaker than mine. She's very vulnerable, but she has been sleeping a lot. So I've been letting her rest. I know when she gets over to sickness, she's gonna be running all over the place like wild woman. But yeah, guys, she's chilling right there. I'm over here doing laundry, I'm washing clothes. So when me and Lyric recover, the boys will have clean stuff to put on and sheets and yada, yada, yada. Being a mom, it just never fails. You just got, always got stuff that you gotta do. And that's part of being an, an adult, not just a mom. So yes, just pray for me, y'all. I love you guys. I don't wanna vlog too much. I want my baby to get all the proper treatment that she needs, the sleep, the make sure she drinks and eats because she did look like she was about to throw up too as well. I threw up earlier myself, so I know how that feels and I know what she's going through because I went through it first, she went through it last. So I'm glad it's just me and her going through it and not all of us, me, the boys, her. That would have been too much, y'all. Like, 
that would have been a whole house full of sickness and we do not deserve this okay so yeah so y'all i'm thinking about closing this vlog right here hopefully the next vlog we do baby lyric will be feeling a lot more better and more alert more alive but i've been sitting right next to my baby making sure she is doing good making sure she's still breathing and i didn't want to bring her to no er sit there for 72 24 to 72 hours and get sick with covid or something worse than covid so we're home we're chilling we're getting the proper care that we need got our medicines and i just want to close off this video well i hope you guys like this video make sure you guys stay tuned to our next live video if you didn't subscribe make sure you guys subscribe right now and hit that bell for post notifications it's your girl shanti it's baby lyric and i just want you guys to stay tuned to our next lit video